Anthony Hudson here for the clash between Fremantle and the Blues. And with me in the box, former Melbourne captain Gary Lyon. Hi, Hutto. Absolute pleasure to be here with you. Today's big game is between the Dockers and Carlton. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp and the crowd are appreciating it. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. It's a big day for the Carlton defenders. They can stop the Dockers from being dominant inside 50. They've got a big chance to win this. A big reception for the home side. The banners are ready for the players. Captains make their way to the centre circle for the coin toss. Fremantle wins the toss. Round 14. Both sitting outside the eight at the moment, but still plenty to play for in this matchup here today. Well, we all know who should get the job done, but its shaping is a very interesting matchup. We prepare for what shapes as an enthralling contest here today. And here we go. It's Fremantle taking on the Blues. He can take off after that handball. McGovern over the top. Not sure if he has the journey from here. He takes the shot. Ends up turning this ball over. Wilson kicks hard along the boundary line. Hughes kicks it out of the back 50. Demand channels a long kick. Blakely marks up contested. Quickly under the boot. The ball rolls across the line. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. A great match. Handballs. Slips the handball to Guidering. Is accepted. Missed the target. The umpire calls for it. Thump clear. Long there to mop up. Long slaps it away. Kick by five. Clean pick up by Collier. Goes by hand. Gets a quick kick away. Great mark. March back. Elects to kick. Takes that one strongly. The kick from Nunes. Fisher gathers it now. Applying the physical pressure. Wilson moves it now. Hogan dug it out. Makes it somebody else's problem. He decides to go for home. That's a monster kick, and it's a goal. His teammates rush over. Fremantle gets the first. We're back in the middle to resume play. Guides it down. Did well to control the ball. Great tackle. Coaches love to see that kind of tackling pressure. Getting in the way was McCarthy. Bart with the intercept. The loose ball picked up. Gathered by Wilson. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Law just slaps it down. Kerno off the deck. Slams it on the boot. Ball off hands. The loose ball scooped up. Slams it onto the boot. Betts gets on the end of this. This will certainly test him from this distance. This kick to tie up the game. Easily takes the mark. Ten metres out.
No problems with that kick from Kasbah. That's his first. He loved that one. The Blues on the scoreboard now. Back with another set of bounce. Cruiser with a big fist on it. Just gets it onto the boot. Does well to cut off the kick. Blakely puts it on the boot. Over the top of the pack. Got boot to ball. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. Goes off the ground, finds the loose ball. Conker will be the recipient of the free. Moves it by foot. Great mark under pressure. Plays on now. Chose to kick it. Rushes with the kick. Blakely dug out the loose ball. Hamling ready to bring it back into play. Found space for an easy mark. Movement by hand. Marchbank collects the loose ball. Wilson hits him hard. Wilson just threw it. A spearing kick from Edz. Does well to keep it in play. Couldn't complete the play. Ball out of bounds. Toss back into play. Got the hands free. He's got the footy in his hands. Missed his target by hand. Uses the bump. Slick with the hands. Murphy on the ball. Getting pushed out of the way was Matera. Gets the handball away. With the ball now. Marks that ball uncontested. Ten metres out. Fantastic goal by Casbolt. That's two now. Finding his feet in front of goals. They get around him after that effort. That's two in a row for Carlton. Carlton by seven points. It's great to watch, Hutto. Plenty of excitement. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. Centre bounce. Wins the ruck duel. Murphy comes away with the ball. The umpire will ball it up. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Fancy footwork, and it's a goal for that. That will settle his nerves. Gets his first on the ball. He's excited about that one. Tap down. Here's Murphy. Long. A bit too casual with the tackle. He just throws that ball. Bike has resources out wide. Nice mark under pressure. Sends the ball inside 50. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. Can he put it through? The top half goes straight between the big sticks. Cox getting the crowd involved. Fremantle trailing by less than two goals. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. That's a really good team goal. About to resume hostilities. Slapped away. Finding the loose ball was Conker. Gets the loose ball. Dishes it off. Nunes will be upset with that. Murphy struggling to run at the moment. Gets the loose ball. Gets the ball out of heavy traffic. Dow takes the mark. Should be relatively straightforward from here. Travelled the journey, but unable to keep it online. Carlton by eight points. As we go into the break, the scores are blue. What can you tell us from the stats, Gaz? Fremantle could have been winning enough of the ball. We're ready for second quarter action. We resume hostilities. Cruiser with the hit. Murphy just too high with the tackle. 
Walters has resources out wide. Fisher gets in the way. Just put it on the boot. Demand wins the foot race. Now we've got a ball up. What can you tell us, Gaz? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. Bent applying physical pressure. The ball bubbling around. Couldn't keep the ball in play. Umpire tosses it in. Took his eyes off the ball. Scoops it up. Gets it away. At full stride. Receives the handball. Kurno won himself a free. This is kickable by his standards. Normally a good shot on goal. Testing shot outside 50. Going for goal number one. A time to celebrate. Kurno loves that goal. Carlton lead by 14. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. It's a turnover. Has it now. It's a turnover. Awkwardly got the handball out. Kicks hurriedly. Fisher gets in a good position. Carlton have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Good mark and looks to send it back. Mundy drives the kick. Akers kicks it long. Doing well to intercept that kick. Decides to kick. Decides to soccer it. Pierce collects it. Finding the ball was Doherty. Demand controlling the airways on this occasion. Demand sends one up towards the wing. Gets into a good position to take it. Couldn't quite with the mark. Brilliant step, picked up by Cripps. The ball mopped up, hacking it out of there. The ball ends up with McKay. Gets the ball out of heavy traffic. A great mark taken there. Uses it across half back. The ball spills to Wilson. I hope that's not serious. He looks to be in a lot of pain. That doesn't look good. I don't think he'll be coming back. Goes with the kick. A mark by Hogan. Looks up with the kick. Cox, a better man there. 35 metres out, lining up from a 45-degree angle. Move it on. A chance to put a second goal on the board. Unbelievable. And they put it through. Congratulated by his teammates. Just two goals in it. Umpire ready to resume play. Thump by Cruiser. Fighting hard was Cripps. McKay gets on the end of this. He gives it a ride. Marks down can send it back. Hamlin just kicks it long. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Drives it out of the pack. Conker takes a strong mark. Moves the ball by foot. He has to hold on to those. Handball's under pressure. Receives the handball and takes off. Just gave it away. Through for the last ball. Nine points the difference. Hamling to bring it in. Marking in space was likely. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Carlton, forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Takes the mark all by himself. Goes for territory. Wins the race to the ball. Landed in his back on this occasion. Looks to move it by foot. He wins the ball in the air. Hogan uses it by foot. Puts on a bump. Hurry kick. Picked up under pressure. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. It's a great match. Manufactures the handball. Handballs to a teammate on the run. Matera loves that goal. Fremantle could kick back-to-back -back goals. Oh, there's nothing in it. 
great bit of play that resulted in that. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Carlton are in front in the clearances and it's allowing them to create pressure up the field and scoring opportunities. He flicks it over. The tackle deserves the free and gets it. Fisher sticks the tackle. Beautiful tackle, Hutto. Goes by foot. Martin takes the mark. He drives it. Murphy takes it well. Testing shot outside 50. Goes with the kick. It's a foot race to get this one. Now we will get a ball up. Punches are clear. He has the ball. Going for goal number one. Cruiser celebrates with the fans. Nine points the difference. We're back in the middle now. Punched away. Shows some physicality. It's cut off by Cruiser. The umpire calls for the ball now. Cruiser got a fist to him. He gets his hands on the footy. A great defensive effort. Dug out the loose ball. Goal scoring opportunity for Banfield. Kicks inside the 50. He gets above the crowd. 35 metres out. Puts it right through the middle. Love kicking that one. The slimmest. A good second term. See the scores. Carlton 33 and Fremantle 30. Carlton will go into the rooms at halftime with plenty of confidence and back themselves for the second half. Let's check out the stats. Carlton have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. It's why they're still in front. Thank you, Gaz. Players taking a much-needed rest as we prepare to launch it. The third quarter about to get underway. About to resume play. Clears the contest. He's got the football now. Got hands to it. This is a big kick in the contest of this game. And kick to hit the front. They trail by less than a goal. Ready to bring it back into play. A strong pack mark. He's the number one ranked player on the ground. He's on fire at the moment. Move it on. He gives it a ride. It's a behind. Fremantle close the gap to one. Looking for options now. Plays on from the kicking. Jones with a spearing kick. A good mark out of the circumstances. Plowman kicks it. He looks like he needs a spell. Handball's out in front. He can take off after that handball. Cruiser had it, lost it. Fisher just put it on the boot. Martin with an easy mark. Hurry kick. He gets another possession. Goal! What a tackle! McGovern creates all sorts of problems for his opponents. Showing some really good pressure there. Going for goal number one. That's the sort of goal that can get the team up and about. The time to celebrate. And don't they get around McGovern. Carlton starting to exert some dominance now. They lead 39 to 32. Kerno might have overworked himself there. Coughed up by Casbol. I haven't seen him for a while, Gas. He needs to find a way into this game. Fisher couldn't be happier with that goal. Carlton have kicked the last two goals. The margin is 13. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. He knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. The game is back underway. 
Carlton are getting beaten at the coalface. They need to rectify these clearance numbers to give themselves the best chance going forward. Bear throws it on. Looks up with the kick. Fisher grabs that one. Move it on. Going for goal number two. Intercepts the ball well. Blakely keeping it low. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Demand tucks it into the pocket. Gets a hand to the ball. Not many touches of the ball for him. Walters uses the body well. The Bulls just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Keeps going. Stuck the bits out there and held on to it. Wilson goes with the kick. Blakely takes the mark and contested. Moves it by foot. A race for the loose ball. Conker collects the loose ball. The umpire will ball it up. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? It's a really entertaining game of football. Constant pressure and rewarded. Great attack on the ball carrier. He gains possession. With the ball is Wilson. Drops the ball. Murphy contests the hard ball. Off the deck. Cleanly picked up. Simpson wants to keep it moving by hand. Stands tall and marks. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. Carlton, forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. Good mark and looks to send it back. Lob gets onto the ball. Well picked up. Fends off the tackler. Moved on by Hamling. A chance to reload the attack now. Moves the ball by foot. Simpson soccers the kick. Dug it out. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. A solid mark from McGovern. McGovern has resources out wide. Carlton are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Doesn't waste any time. Fife landed in his back on this occasion. Somehow got the ball out. Takes possession. He wins possession. The umpire calls for a stoppage. Pierce thumped it clear. Conker in a spot of bother. Brilliant chance. Sock is a kick. Mundy gains some territory. Fife needs a chance to rest. Matera clean from the half volley. Dockerty gets a quick kick away. Mops up the loose ball. Hacking it out of there. Looks like the ball will be coming back. The Blues haven't been able to set up any set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning title that way. Marks now and can send it back. Finds a target. The kick from Kerno. Drops the mark. Nunes not getting much of it, Gaz. He's barely touched the ball lately. Landed in his back on this occasion. O'Brien elects to kick. Kennedy runs after this one. They can link up now. Jones puts it on the boot. What a brilliant tackle. Fife finds a way to hang on. Fence. What did you think of the third term, Gaz? Carlton will be looking to not only hold their lead, but they want to put this beyond doubt early and run away with a big win. Let's see what the stats have to show. Fremantle are finding plenty of the ball in space, but they're struggling to convert it to scores. If they can improve their ball use, they'll... We have one quarter of footy ahead of us. Let's go. Can't afford any mistakes from here. They have to be perfect. Carlton aren't making the most of their hitouts. It's going straight to the opposition. Walters gets on the end of that handball. Just landed in his back. A piercing kick from Wiedering. Finds this and marks well. 
Elects to kick. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's having a real quiet match, Hutto. Doherty manufactures a handball. Quickly onto the boot. Kerner did well to win that ball. Carlton fans would love to see this one sail through. They're doing really well to chew some time off the clock here. Can he put it through? Good mark there. Uses it by foot. Gets into some space to mark this. Wilson kicks it. Steady hands there as he holds that one. Looks to move it by foot. It's marked by Hamlin. Fisher cuts it off. The loose ball picked up. Casbah couldn't stick the tackle. Off hands from Murphy. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's barely touched the ball, Hunter. Chips it towards half forward. Good body work to win the mark. Carlton could allow him too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. So, what can Carlton do with this opportunity in front of goal? He goes for broke. Casbah gets in a good position. Putting this one through would give Carlton plenty of confidence. Going for goal number three. His teammates rush over. The lead is now 19. Back in the middle now as the rucks go at it. Lob with a big fist on it. Picks up the loose ball. Needs a bit of a rest. Opportunity for Mundy is in his possession. A chance to gather the ball. He gives away a free for in the back. Bent with a drilling ball. Kerno drops the mark. And the umpire says, my ball. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. Penetrating handball. Five marks in a bit of space. It's going to be close. for Fremantle. They need to kick a few now. Lob on the hit out. Using every ounce of energy he has left. The handball now from Kerno. Kicks hurriedly. Bent goes off the ground. Off the ground. He's kicked the goal. Cashbox increases the lead. Look at them celebrate that effort. Carlton beginning to apply their supremacy on the scoreboard with a lead of 57 to 38. Punched away. The ball in the hands of Five. Intercepted by Pierce. Cripps gets the loose ball. The ball finds down. Almost directly in front here. A chance to put a second goal on the ball. He blasts it through for another. That pushes the lead further out. Dow enjoying that goal. That's two in a row for Carlton. Now they lead by 25. Cruiser thumps it forward. Lobs the handball. Kennedy drives the kick. Marks all alone. McKay with the opportunity in front of goal. Needs a big kick if he's going to put this through. Going for goal number one. Nails the goal. This one gives them a bigger lead. McKay celebrating hard. The Blues have kicked the last three goals. Margin getting dangerous now. Walters wins it back. Just manufactures what he could. Has it now. Nunes gets streaming past and gets the footy. Kennedy gains possession. Cruiser scoops it up. Hit the man hard. A free kick to Fremantle. Lob uses it by foot. Finds this one all by himself. Collier keeps coming. Ball collected. March back. Unable to lay the tackle. Ends up turning his ball over. O'Brien clearing kick out of the defensive 50. Cripps ran it back. Polkart couldn't complete the tackle. They are desperate for a goal now. You can see that happening right after it left his boot. 
Well, the margin's large, and time is certainly against them. Found space for an easy mark. Plough attacks it into the pocket. The mark is taken by Doherty. Keeps the kick low. Gets into a good position to take that. He drives it. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Uses it now. Jones got under it. A spearing kick. Does well to cut off the kick. Carlton haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball's been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning title that way. Intercepts the ball well. Collects the loose ball. Puts boot to ball. Open opportunity for Cripps. Got boot to ball. Marked by Blakely. Fremantle in a bit of trouble. What stood out for you today, Gary? Just a fantastic performance from Carlton. They really put in the hard yards and they can enjoy the result. Thanks, guys. The final scores stand at Carlton 69, Fremantle 39. Thanks to Gary Lyon for joining us. We'll see you all later. Thanks, Hutto. Until next time.